Introducing first, they are Team Black and White. Making his way to the ring from Chulio to Florida, weighing 275 pounds, one half of the WCW World Tag Team Champions, Good Hall! Well, Dave Pinter said you can win it by pinfall or over the top rope. Two ways to win this battle royal. Well, two ways to be eliminated. Yes, two ways to be eliminated. But and you anyone know, could win it. Let's go back to David Pinzer once again. Standing seven feet four inches tall, tonight weighing 533 pounds, the but, other half but, but, of but the thanks. WCW World Tag Team Champions is the He's made it personal with he and Goldberg. Oh, yeah. From Robbinsdale, Minnesota, weighing 262 pounds. has won a battle royal, except Goldberg. Matter of fact, it's the first time that Goldberg has ever competed in a battle royal. And it's so dangerous, because you got so many big men in there. And from Minneapolis, Minnesota, weighing 327 pounds, Scott Christorton. They are NW Hollywood. And I think based on what we have seen over the past couple of years from members of the NWO, it'll be a first time in a battle royal where I really think you're going to see decisive team lines draw. As a matter of fact, if anything, Goldberg's the odd man in this thing. It's going to be he more like an eight-man tag. And one man by himself. Yeah. One man is the man. The man. Goldberg. Scott Hall has the microphone. Hey, yo. It's that time in the show when we like to take a little survey. So is there anybody here at Road Wild that came to see that red hot black and white express? There's your answer, Polly. That's the money in a miracle here. Ladies and gentlemen, it is time to introduce Team Red and Black. First, from North Scottsdale, Arizona, weighing 328 pounds, the leader of the pack, Big Sexy, Kevin Nash. Well, I guess we're finally going to get to see that confrontation. Kevin Nash and Scott Hall, Big Sexy, the giant killer. I guess, what is it, medium sexy the Nash sexy, killer? Me today. Oh, Super he's changed it now. Well, well, why, why were you talking to him today? Well, I, I was... You're, you're, are you what, in cahoots? You with, no, the, you were, what were you doing? It's NWO Black and White. I was just... I'm a, I'm a broadcast journalist. I was in the back and... I, uh, I happen to be uh, uh, reminiscing about the, uh, the... All right, don't bury yourself anymore. He, he came to me. All right, let's go back to David Pinter again. From Venice Beach, California, weighing 256 pounds, this is Oh, he can't come out of the ceiling here. And look at this. This is a From Chicago, 270 pounds. He's the total package. Let's Luke And finally from Mexico City, weighing 249 pounds, Conan! They are the NWO Wolfpack! 
smart move to stay together before going to the ring individually, wouldn't you think, with the NWO black and white in the ring? Great oh, yeah. strategy. Keep it as a unit. And just amazing, it continues, the trend continues everywhere we go across this country, across the world. They love the Wolfpack. Yes, they do. Wolfpack in the house! Back to the point about Hall and Nash. If Nash keeps his sights on Hall and makes that his only target, a lot of times that's not a good no, piece not. of strategy to use in a battle royal. The secret to winning a battle royal is to stay out of the way. That's Let right. everybody eliminate one another. Then when no one's looking, you dump them out. And finally, Watch he's this. from Ports Unknown, weighing 296 pounds, with a record of 129 wins and zero losses, the WCW World Heavyweight Champion, the undefeated Goldberg! There he is, the man, the heavyweight champion of the world. And what a unique situation it is for a world heavyweight champion oh. to be involved in a battle royal. He volunteered for this. He threw his hat into the ring. And he remains undefeated at 129 and 0. And you know what he's thinking? He wants to get his hands around the Giants' neck. That's what Goldberg wants. There he is. <laughs> Yeah. I'm sure there's going to be a lot of that before this one's over. Be a lot of those uppercuts. The man who has been so awesome in singles competition, how does he plan strategy for this? Who's next? Could be a lot of them. So nine men will go into this Road Wild Battle Royal. One man is very much a loner. Tony, that's another great point you made. Used to singles competition. What about ring positioning when there's so many other wrestlers in the ring? How's he going to be able to react to that? Well, if you take it for what it's worth, the track record for the man named Goldberg. Okay, here we go. The bell sounds. How much experience did he have before he won the world title? 